All right, this one's going to be on QUVI. I think it's pronounced uh, QV, but it is a command line tool for parsing video download links. What does all that mean? Basically, you can actually download uh, videos off of like sites like YouTube, or you can actually stream the video too. Uh, so it's kind of like a YouTube DL competitor slash alternative. All right, it doesn't have a lot of supported sites, but uh, you know it has all the popular one I think. All right. Anyways, how do you use this? And let's get a video from YouTube here. So I'm gonna use one of mine. This one here. And we just copy the link. Basically, you go in here, you type in QV, get, and then you paste in the URL. And what it's going to do is going to download the video here. And we'll wait for it to finish. It's only 17 megabytes, I believe. So, And once you're done, you can list it out here, and you see we have that uh, XFCE video, and we can play it using M Player or any other player that you have. And there you go. This is the video, right? And we can go forward and all that, so on and so forth. So that's how that works. If you want to download, now if you want to stream it, um, you can do your QV dump. Let's do another video like a. Uh, Let's do this video, this piano video. And we're going to do dash B for quiet here. And we're going to do dash dash execute. Let's spell it right. And we use like M player to play this here. What is that? Uh, I think it was percent U. All right. And basically what this would do is that it's not going to download the video, it's just going to stream it to our M player video or M player or any other player I believe you can use. And there you go, we have to wait for it to pop up, but there you go, look at that. Plays the video, right, there's no downloading or anything like that, um, but it's playing here. Just so to show you, see it's playing, so on and so forth. And if you list it out, it doesn't actually download the video or anything like that. So that's pretty much it for the program. Like those are the two options I would use. I mean, they have other options in here if you want to do it. If you do QV-H, they have like uh, an info, a scan, and so on and so forth. But for the most part, I, I don't really need to use that. Now, if you want to get more uh, help on those individual commands, they tell you right here, QV help and then command. So if I want to get help on um, the git command, then I'll do that, and I can look at the man page for that, whatever. Or if I want to get help on the uh, dump command and what it means and everything. So what we used was dash b, right? What was that here? This dash b, and the dash b is basically for different like log message or error message, but we use quiet, so we have no errors. All right, uh, when it outputs, and what's the other one? Execute. Uh, let's go back to E here. Yeah, we use uh, what the hell is that? Go back. What the hell? Yeah, we use this one, uh, dash dash execute, or you can use just dash E here. But basically, though, that does is that it'll allow you to open another command line uh, program, which we use uh, M player, right? And, and that's how we start everything. Anyways, uh, hopefully you understand all that. And what sites are the support? They don't actually have a command to list the supported sites, but uh, we can use this other command. Um, if you ever use CC Live, it's basically they're using the same backend. Give you an example I'm talking about here. They use the same lib uh, QV here. If I do the other one, what was that one? Info. Right, they use the same lib uh, uh, programs in the back end. So you can actually just use CC Live dash U and see a list of supported sites here. So there's supported sites. Uh, they don't have a lot, like I said. I mean, YouTube DL has, for the most part, too many already. This one, it's kind of like uh, only a few. And you can see it has YouTube, it has, uh, I don't know, some of these other sites I don't even use. But SoundCloud. Um, so not all the popular ones, but some of the popular ones.
there you go that's the supported sites and what else can we do that's pretty much it I do have these aliases in there because I'm not gonna remember those stupid things so where the hell was the aliases here uh, these are two aliases I made here this one is QVDL so once you want to do DL you can do that or you can do streaming and this is the, how you will set it up uh, you can set your variable player or you can type in your you know M player VLC or whatever it is it's up to you but pretty simple is uh, let's put out this here if I want to download or something like that let's download something small okay this three minute video here okay copy that and if I want to download that I just use QV uh, DL paste this in here and there you go that's how those uh, functions aka aliases work um, and I'll download it so we'll wait for that video to finish It's 22 megs here and you can see we have our Cody COI uh, video here that we can watch um, now if you want to just stream it let's say let's stream I don't know, let's say this written video or whatever copy of that and if I want to stream it only I can do QV uh, stream and this one will open with my M player in a few minutes there you go opens it and then it'll play it uh, you know without any output or anything like that anywho that is QV uh, an alternative to YouTube DL and that's about it for this video.